All right, YouTube, I'm just coming from the gym. Um, I'm a fitness influencer for those who are just seeing me. Um, a lot of people are looking at me and saying, why you got a video about this and you a fitness influencer? I also got a deadlift video that I just filmed. I'm at the gym right now, all right? So I'm at Crunch Fitness. Um, I'm just leaving. But when I was doing my cardio, I was on the stair stepper. I was watching Fresh and Fit, and they said something about this might be the end of Fresh and Fit, and I wanted to see what they was talking about. I thought it was clickbait when I first saw it, um, but they don't have ads right now. They don't have a partnership with YouTube right now. You can't super chat. You can't do anything right now, so YouTube finally got them, and at the end of the day, um, how do I feel about it? That's what the video's about. How do I feel about it? Um. For those who've been watching me for a while, you might know I made videos about Fresh and Fit. Some positive, some negative. Or one or two, maybe three negative. All right. Um, that was about the Abbott and Preach situation. I really didn't like what they said um, or how they went about that situation. Um, not the fact that they retaliated back. I'm not really a fan of Abbott and Preach. I really don't know. I don't know if they're good or not. I don't really watch. I don't watch everybody. All right. So, um, but what I'm saying is I didn't like the way they handled the situation. So, um, looking into the situation, I would have retaliated too, but I wouldn't have retaliated that way. But this is not about that situation. This is about what I feel about this situation. Um, how do I feel about fresh and fit as a whole? Not just that one situation. Um, I feel like they was very needed. Um, I don't have beef or gripe with them. Um, I don't have anything with them at the end of the day. I just feel like a lot of young impressionable men need guidance these days. All right. I'm um, not saying they're the perfect people to guide somebody, but they had a lot of positive things to say also, um, whether you agree with everything or not. You're not supposed to agree with everything. Don't even agree with everything I say. All right. Then you're just a yes, man. Don't don't be like that. So basically, they're teaching young men to stand on their own to have their own opinion, things like that. Um, that's very needed these days. I mean, a lot of people don't even try to have their own opinion. A lot of people don't even try to have individuality. A lot of people grown men these days especially even young men but even older men than me i'm 40 years old i just turned 40 years old august 4th um best shape in my life i got videos about how to get fitness and that the third um these guys they're teaching people how to get fit how to get money out of this how to get that um on a fitness level nah myron uh i don't really think you teach people how to get fit bro i mean i'm just saying i'm just comparing it to me all right but everything else, I mean, I like a lot of things they done done, all right? They reached a million subs on YouTube. They done done all this. They done done all that. Um, you might agree or disagree with how they um, react with uh, women. Um, I agree with a lot of the stuff, all right? But I disagree with some of it also, all right? Um, I got my own mind, you know? I don't think that everything is simping or, or saving or I believe we should respect women. Um, I'm not saying they're disrespecting women, but there's arguments to the way that the household should be. But at the same time, I can't I can't control nobody else's household but mine. I just be listening. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I just be listening, putting my two cents in. Um, but they will be still like on Rumble and things like that. Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, maybe. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if they're still going to be posting on YouTube. Uh, if they're not getting paid from YouTube, I don't I don't know. Um, but I'm I'm pretty sure they probably will to promote the other things. I'm just this is my guess. This is all my guess. I'm just saying what I would do. I mean they still got a lot of they're still gonna get a lot of views, so it's still like free advertisement for their other things. So that's what I would do. I mean, if I was them. But um you tell me what you think in the comments. At the end of the day, I'm kind of pressed for time, so I do have to go. Um, I just left the gym. I got to go to work. I got to eat. Um, I got a lot of things to do. Take a shower. I got to, I'm, I'm crunch time. When I cut this camera off, I'm, I'm scurrying and hurrying. But I had to touch on this because, um, also shout out to Naomi's dream. Um, she made the thumbnail for this video because, uh, that's when I made the album and Pete. She, she sent me a couple thumbnails through Instagram and I greatly appreciate that. I'm going to reuse it. Um, 
I'm gonna reuse one of them. Uh, I don't know which one I'm gonna use yet, but um, I'm saying um a lot in this video because I'm I'm pressed for time. I gotta go. I gotta go. Hopefully, I, I hopefully I did this justice with my opinion. Um, I just I I I see why it's a lot of controversial things. Um, 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 um I'm gonna say it ten more times. Um. Uh, there's a lot of controversial things, especially the album piece. There's a lot of things that could be the reason, all right? So you got to watch what you do, what you say, all right? But at the same time, the freedom of speech and this and that and the third, but you got to remember that this is a platform that has rules, you know? You got to look at all of that. That's just like if you go to work and you got to have on steel toe boots and you go in there with Jordans on, what you expect? That's just like if you got a house and you got to pay your rent and you don't pay it, what you expect? You know, um, so I'm going to 